What's up guys? It's Battlestyle SPL. Chuck, back again. This time we got uh, Muscle Car Garage Hobby Collection Series 5. Um, you'll notice there's three cars here and I'll uh, explain why. Okay, so this was the normal, the normal release in the regular Hobby Collection packaging. And then they came out with this one for... I don't know why must have been for like a special promotion or whatever but it's the exact same car so I'm not going to open it Oops, sorry but yeah it is the exact same car I'll do close-ups in a minute here but all right so let's get these ones open this one comes with a cool toolbox, which is the hobby collections. They sometimes came with special things, which is pretty cool. Also, I was watching uh, Joe Motors, one of his videos today that has the, this javelin. And there's another javelin that they did, which... show you guys at a later date which I also have and they spelled Mark Donahue's name wrong on um, well, he did a, he did a comparison between the green lights and the hot wheels and this one is the only one where his name is spelled right was on this release but the hot wheels got it wrong and then the other green light one got it wrong too which is kind of odd you would think uh their editors or fact checkers would, you know, look into that stuff before they go into production or printing of packages, I guess. This one comes with a cool little toolbox. One's yellow and then one is in the emerald green, which is pretty cool. But anyway, let's take a look at the first one. It's pretty much just the normal release, you know, of a 71 Mark Donahue Trans Am, you know, Javelin, you know, except for it should have different exhausts like if you go watch Joe Motors video you'll, you'll notice the the um the Hot Wheels version has a more correct exhaust this one just has like factory uh, number 1835 so uh, this one doesn't have a has a blank plate same with this one but it is uh, from the muscle car hobby muscle car garage hobby 5 release it's got all the cool little sponsor badges on there. We've got Goodyear, and then Javelin, and Sunoco Champion, and then the Trans Am Racing logo. It's got hood pins on there, which are pretty sweet. It's a pretty nice car. Number six on the trunk, and on the hood, doors. Pretty iconic race car. And then here's the green machine. Same thing, except for, again, with the... The green, the green wheels, good years on it, and green base. This one is also not numbered, or doesn't even have a spot for the number. Usually it would have been like right there, but yeah, because that's where that one is. There's that one on there, but so anyway, we'll do a, if you look at it, it's exactly the same car. Now the later one that Greenlight produced, which I'll show you later, um, the major difference of it is the the wheels are more a brighter silver instead of like a gunmetal. And then something that I noticed that I picked up in Joe Motors' video was the blue is a little bit darker on this original release. So, but anyway, 
this is your unboxing of the hobby five release all right thanks guys thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one